FDA rejected it twice before, but it's now approving the first prescription drug to boost sexual desire in women. Whitney Burbank spoke to a local researcher who's been studying the pink pill for more than a decade. One of the major researchers behind the little pink pill making national headlines has an office right here in West Palm Beach. This has been uh, 17 years and there's been several drugs that have not passed the FDA. Tuesday, Flibanzarin got the FDA approval. Dr. Stanley Altoff has been studying the drug for more than a decade. And before that, he was researching Viagra. While Flibanzarin is being dubbed the female Viagra, Altoff says there are some key differences between the drugs, starting with the name. The pill for women is called Addy. Viagra works by increasing blood flow and Addy works on the woman's brain. Women prescribed Addy will take it once a day, while men can pop a Viagra on an as-needed basis. Altoff says Addy targets key chemicals in the brain, and it's specifically aimed at treating hypoactive sexual desire disorder. He says HSDD affects nearly one in ten women. It will not help women who are in bad relationships, who are depressed, or whose low desire is due to life stress. The drugs manufacturers say the pill should be available for consumers sometime in October. In West Palm Beach, Whitney Burbank, WPBF 25 News.